May peace be upon you, my Christian brothers and sisters. Did you know that the mother of Jesus is mentioned more than 100% times in the Quran than she is mentioned in the Bible? The Holy Quran, this is the great recitation, is the final revelation sent by God to mankind and promised by God Almighty that the Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, is the last and final messenger sent for mankind. My Christian brothers and sisters, you may not know that the Quran actually mentions miracles that God did through Jesus that are not even mentioned in the Holy Bible. Go order your free copy of the Holy Quran and learn new things that you didn't know about Jesus, the son of Mary. Peace and blessings be upon him. What God says about Jesus, about the Christians, about the Jews, Moses, Ibrahim, Abraham, Noah, and all the prophets that we all believe as Muslims and Christians. You should read the Quran because God tells us our purpose for this life in the Quran. He tells us and he warns us about the life to come, that this world is not permanent. It is only temporary and there is life after this world. We need to know our purpose for this life because we all submit to something. People submit to money. People submit to their own desires. People submit to their own children. But obviously we should submit to the creator because if we don't submit to the creator then we end up submitting to the creation and in the bible jesus says it himself he says i do not my will but the will of the one that sent me and he also said to get eternal life you keep the commandments and the commandments they don't mention anything about jesus or a trinity or crucifixion or son of god or resurrection or dying for sins none of this but that God is one and you love him with all your heart, your mind, and your strength. This is a Muslim. By definition, a Muslim is one who submits to the creator. So go to my uh, website, brooklynmuslim.com. I'll show you. Here you go. brooklynmuslim.com. And order your free copy of the Holy Quran. It's completely free. People like Andrew Tate becoming Muslim. I became Muslim. Why leave that whole lifestyle to become Muslim? Why are these people doing the same? Because it's the truth. Islam, it means submission to the creator. And this is the purpose of life. Peace be upon you. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.